welcome to my channel and I'm back with you once again with another video of Microsoft Flight Simulator 24. Nowadays, I'm exploring the fly-by-wire Airbus A380 and in this regard, I'm planning to make a series of videos of this plane so that I can just break down all the information related to a flight into different videos which will make it easy for you to look for a specific information on my channel. Before this, I've uploaded a video in which I've shown you how to install the fly-by-wire Airbus A380 for the Microsoft Flight Simulator 24. Now in this video, I will show you how to connect the electronic flight bag or the EFB of this plane with your SimBrief and Navigraph account and then I will be uploading videos in which I will show you how to configure the EFB and the FMS, how to fly this plane on autopilot and how to perform an ILS approach and landing. I will give you all the links in the description and you can just go and follow any of the link as per your learning curve for this plane. Now let's press Shift 0 and go to the EFB. Now over here you will see this option settings and in the settings you have to go to this option third party options. Now first of all, let's enter the SimBrief user ID. So this is simbrief.com and you can just create your account over here for free. But for the ARAC cycle, which has the information of the A ports, the waypoints and the airways, you have to have a Navigraph subscription. So if you go to the account settings after creating your account, you can get the pilot ID from here. All you have to do is this, just simply type in the pilot ID in the EFB. Now over here, 557363. So that's it. And if I click anywhere, then it will be automatically connected to the SimBrief account. It will just take some time and that's it. Now, if you have the Navigraph subscription, you can also connect the Navigraph account with this EFB and then you can access the charts. So this is the option where you can access the charts. So if I just go back and go back to third party options, I can just link this account. So link account. Now over here, you can scan this QR code with your mobile phone and then you can just log into your Navigraph account. I'm just uh, scanning this QR code and I will try to authenticate that and allow and that's it. And now you have uh, the Navigraph account connected to the EFB and now you can access the Navigraph charts. And uh, I have made a flight plan before so you can see the flight plan is there and now I can import the flight plan. Now in the next video, I will show you how to configure the EFB and uh, the FMS of this plane for the flight. So this was a simple video for the beginners. If you don't know how to do uh, this uh, procedure, then it's here for you. And if you have got any questions, you can ask me in the comment section or if you want to add anything to this video, the comment section is there for you. Thank you very much for watching and have a nice day. Hope to see you soon.